All right, all right, everybody. Man, I'm getting this thing ripped out, man. I'm starting to lay down the foundation. That's going to be the bottom of my box of my six order. Man, this thing is going to be ridiculous. Now that I'm not on the road anymore, guys, I'm going to do something real cool with this particular build. I'm building this one. Now, I know I'm going to build for myself, but this time I'm building it for y'all. I'm coming with a six order. Got six kings in there. They uh 6500 RMS. They hold up the 15,000 watt peak, four and a half inch coil on them. Them things is pretty nice, man. Uh All right, guys, I might sound a little hoarse here, man. I've been up doing this build here uh, pretty much straight through. It took me around 22 hours to get this thing built. And I finally got it done. Now, don't criticize the screws, okay? Because I, I use my method. I have to use screws because I don't have a facility with their capability where I can either uh, clamp it down and let the glue dry and all that. So uh, eventually I'll go back in there and I will remove all the screws. And plus, I don't have a truck yet. Uh, so I'm definitely, I can't do it at home and then bring it up here. So this is my method of doing things. As you see, you're gonna see cracks. I'm gonna just show you how it is in here. You're gonna see cracks, you're gonna see nails and screws. But as you notice, the big boys ain't in there. So what, what that mean? That mean the top is gonna come back off so I can set the subs down in the inside. This design was designed by Randy Ritchie. You can find him on Facebook. He's a good guy. If you need your sub design, he damn sure will get you windy. Uh, I'm kinda kind of afraid of this thing but it's going to be an interesting build guys the surrounding the cosmetics that I'm going to do on here I'm not going to have a motorized wall anymore I don't need the sleeper uh, my batteries is going to be built in a uh, plexiglass enclosure over there uh, this whole uh I just want to be an eye catcher. So my amps is not going to be sitting on the wall. They're going to be closed up. I want to have that into a, a plexiglass a sealed off area too. So it's going to be pretty, pretty interesting, man. I know it's going to be windy. I'm going to build this thing here uh, like it's going to be here to stay. Because it's not designed by me. I do a lot of guessing. I start getting a little better. But I, I like the wind, so I'm building. I'm, I'm building this because I guys, I want you all to see some some furniture moving around. Let me show you where I'm gonna put the batteries. All right, my batteries is gonna be over here. Uh, I only need three to start this thing, guys. Um, but I got six of them all together. I'm gonna clean them up. Like I say, have a glass case there. I'm still gonna have the swinging door, most likely. With, with the mids and highs when I open this up. Uh, I don't really know the uh, the specs on this enclosure. All I know is that I I told them I don't care if I hit a 189 or 89. I just want it to be windy. Well, he gave, my, he gave me his word and said, once you build this, if you follow it down to the T, you're gonna have all the wind you need. So I'm ready to see guys how this thing gonna look. How it's gonna sound inside the black mumble. I made a mess out here, but I got a lot of stuff to clean up, but this is the only tools I got. This is my workplace. Now I gotta clean it up, but uh,
Man, it's gonna be nice. That thing, that thing, it looks scary, don't it? Especially when you see them big butts sitting up there, man, the magnet's gonna be sticking up out of there. Oh, Lord. Uh, man, I got it three and a quarter inch, just like he said, from the ceiling. And you see that port going all the way down in the inside. Man, look, I followed it to the T. Now we're about to see what's gonna happen. Uh, Y'all know me. I might just have to fire it up before I finish modifying my truck. Hey, I'm pretty sure it's gonna make me bag down. Like, oh, okay, you ain't ready to turn this thing up. Not yet. All right, guys, we're gonna be going on vacation here in a couple more weeks. There ain't gonna be no more hiring, man. Uh, we putting the freeze on hiring again, boy. Y'all just coming in and and uh, filling out the applications and signing on with us. But love to y'all. I got the Mix Max for sale. If anybody wants the Mix Max, let me know. Let me know.